video, we will review how to edit an imported building file in 3D Sketch, add floors, and generate area metrics. If you would like to make an edit to your imported OBJ, you can do so in 3D Sketch. 3D Sketch is an advanced modeling sub-mode in Forma that you can use to create and modify complex shapes. To edit this imported OBJ building in 3D Sketch, select the building in the canvas and choose Edit in 3D Sketch. A pop-up will ask you if you would like to convert this object. Click Convert Object to continue. You have now entered the 3D Sketch submode. We are going to edit our building to make it taller and to curve the front edges of the building. Let's first select the front face. A series of tools will become visible on the toolbar to the right. Let's click the Flatten Faces button. Now select the roof face of the building. Locate the Extrude button on the toolbar and select it. Now find the face centroid on the roof face and select. You can either drag the face upward along the z-axis or enter the desired height. Let's put 75 feet and click enter. Click escape to exit the extrude tool. Now we'll curve the sides of our building. Select the Arc by Three Points Sketching Tool. Click to start drawing the arc from the edge midpoint. And click the opposite edge midpoint. And expand the arc. Let's repeat that on the other edge. Now select one of the new curved triangle faces you created. Find the extrude button and extrude down towards the ground. Extruding down will delete the geometry, leaving us with the curved building edges. Click Escape to exit the tool. Lastly, let's slope the roof of our building. Select the rear edge of the building. Locate the Move tool in the toolbar and go back to select the edge midpoint. You can either drag up the z-axis or you can enter a specified length on your toolbar. Let's enter 20 feet and click Escape. Now that we have edited our imported OBJ building, let's add floors. Currently, our building is identified in Forma as a generic object. In order to get area metrics like GFA, RA, and building coverage, you must add floors. Ensure that your entire building is selected. You should see an option to add floors on the right hand side. Go ahead and click add floors. Floor stacks will automatically be generated for the building in the canvas and now you can see area metrics. We can also adjust the height of the floors on the right and see the changes reflected in the canvas.
Once the building looks good, click the check mark at the top of the screen to finish your 3D sketch session and to save your work.